The Cannes Film Festival recently faced significant controversy when a bodyguard was accused of racist behavior toward Yuna from Girls' Generation. This incident has not only marred the festival's reputation but also brought to light several concerning issues within the industry. The bodyguard in question is currently facing a lawsuit amounting to 150 million won. This legal action stems from an incident where Yuna, a member of the famous South Korean girl group Girls' Generation, was reportedly dragged away from the Ken red carpet. Despite her stunning appearance making international headlines, the focus quickly shifted to the bodyguard's inappropriate conduct. The guard's actions included stopping Yuna from taking more pictures and forcefully removing her from the event. Which many have condemned as not just rude but racially discriminatory, what makes the situation even more alarming is the revelation that Yuna was not the only victim of such treatment. Fans and onlookers observed similar disrespectful behavior towards other women of color at the festival. Among them was Kelly Rowland, who was also pushed off the red carpet, an incident she later discussed with AP News. Additionally, Masiel Tavares faced rude treatment, adding to the mounting allegations against the festival's security team. The lawsuit has been initiated by Ukrainian model and renowned fashion TV host Sawa Pontichska, who has accused the Cannes Film Festival organizing committee of causing her mental and physical harm. Seeking 100,000 euros, approximately 150 million won, in damages, Pontichska's claim includes allegations of psychological trauma and reputational damage. She asserts that she had a legitimate ticket at the time and did nothing to warrant such treatment. Despite her attempts to contact the organizing committee for an apology, she received no response, prompting her to take legal action. This controversy has ignited discussions about discrimination and racism within the industry, with many fans wondering if Yuna will pursue similar legal action. Her participation in the red carpet event was not only impeded but also marred by the rude and violent behavior she endured. The bodyguard's actions have drawn significant public scrutiny. And the Ken Film Festival is now under immense pressure to address these serious allegations. The extensive media coverage and the public's reaction to this incident have significantly impacted the festival's reputation. It highlights broader concerns about racism in the entertainment industry, prompting other celebrities to share their own experiences of discrimination. Yuna's fans have expressed outrage over the treatment she received, adding to the calls for accountability and change. Pontichka's lawsuit might pave the way for changes in security policies at major events like the Ken Film Festival. If successful, her case could set a precedent for addressing and rectifying similar incidents in the future. The outcome of this lawsuit is eagerly awaited by many, as it could lead to significant reforms and a stronger stance against racism and discrimination in the industry. Importance of respect and equality, the incident highlights the critical need for respect and equality in all settings, especially high-profile events like film festivals. Discrimination based on race or any other factor is unacceptable and must be actively addressed and prevented. Accountability and transparency, organizations and events must hold their staff accountable for their actions. Transparent investigations and responses to such incidents are essential to maintain trust and integrity, legal recourse and rights protection. Victims of discrimination have the right to seek legal recourse. Sawa Pontichka's lawsuit demonstrates that legal action can be a powerful tool in holding perpetrators accountable and seeking justice, raising awareness, media coverage and public discourse around such incidents are vital in raising awareness about discrimination and prompting societal change. The significant attention this incident received underscores the power of public opinion in addressing injustices, impact on reputation, the reputation of events and organizations can be severely impacted by incidents of discrimination. Ensuring respectful and fair treatment of all participants is crucial to maintaining a positive public image. Need for policy reforms. This incident could lead to reforms in security and event management policies to prevent future occurrences of similar behavior. It underscores the necessity for clear guidelines and training for staff to handle situations professionally and without bias, support for victims. It's important for organizations to provide support to victims of discrimination and to address their concerns promptly. Ignoring or dismissing such incidents can lead to greater backlash and harm to all parties involved. Cultural sensitivity, events attracting a diverse international audience must ensure cultural sensitivity and inclusivity in their operations. This includes training staff to understand and respect different cultural backgrounds and norms.